in this video we're going to dive deep into the scale or the y scale here what we're going to do is we're going to figure out how we can remove specifically these lines here the grid lines how we can remove the tick lines and of course the tick labels but this will be very interesting because you can choose what to show or what to hide based on this so let's start to explore this right now in this video we're going to answer one of the viewers question which is how to hide numbers in the y-axis scale in chart.js and this question came from one of my other videos about how to hide tooltips in the donut chart in chart.js so in here if we scroll down you can see eventually this question came from Deza Tolatino a special thank you to Deza for asking this question and this is what Deza asked how to hide the numbers in the y-axis I'm trying to hide the numbers on the left side of the bars bar chart i already hide the grid lines but i can't hide the numbers all right so i'm going to show you how to hide all these individual aspects of the y-axis scale so you know exactly which part you can pinpoint and remove as well so to do this what we need to do first is get our default code go to charges3.com getting started and there you can find our default code if you see this please uh, understand right now I have some issues with my Google Chrome however Vue.js is giving me the same error right I do not know as of now however it is all safe and all we need here basically is to copy this chunk of code here so copy this code and if you would like to understand this code watch this specific video here now what I'm going to do we're going to paste this code in here and once we're done with that I'm going to cut it out and what I will do here eventually is put in it in here so we have the title save that and refresh now we have a bar chart and what we want to do eventually is remove the numbers and probably these ticks here as well and you have the grid lines already removed so sometimes you might want to remove the grid lines but not these ticks here or the tick labels here so what we're going to do is we're going to remove one by one of them so you know exactly how to pinpoint what to remove and what to show so first of all go down here and then all we have to do here is basically go in the y axis we in the scales y axis and we have this here and I'll just leave this because it's just default and then what I want to do here is to pinpoint so to answer your question immediately all we have to do here is basically this we can say it ticks which is the namespace we need to pinpoint so basically in the y axis we go into the ticks and then from the ticks here curly braces and then you say display fonts. If I save this now and make sure we have a comma here for a continuation of this, refresh, you can see now the numbers or the y axis uh, tick labels are gone. However, if you carefully look, we have this tick here. You might say, well, if we just do the following, I'm going to show you exactly what we're going to do. Let's put in here a comma and we say here grid. And the reason why grid and not grid lines because in charge s3 they move from grid lines to grid charge s2 uses grid lines and in charge s3 they're using the, the namespace grid so in here 30 braces and then what we could do here is we can just say very default display fonts if we do this if we refresh you can see it removes all of the items including the grid sometimes you want to keep the lines here a lot, uh, visible while well, you want to remove these tick lines here so how can we do this because now it removes both of it both of it at immediately and I don't want this I want to maybe keep the grid lines but I want to remove the tick lines and the tick lines that I refer to is these lines here these mini lines here that are basically as well here so how do we do this if I save this here again refresh you can see here you have these mini lines these are called the tick lines and this here from here to here is called the grid line but basically how they're divided is one is on the chart area and the other one is outside of it so let's start to do the following we say here draw ticks with a capital T and then we say here display false if I do this and refresh oh sorry I guess I need to not do display false by default set it as this so we just make this draw ticks false and if I refresh here you can see now the tick lines has been disappeared without removing the grid lines because sometimes you want to have the grid lines if you want to only remove the grid lines this is the following that we can do we can say here draw on chart 
area and in here we just say false so this what will happen here make sure you have a comma here this one here will now remove the grid lines here to show you this i need to make this set on true or just remove this one and display false what we could do here just this one will say um true display true let's save this and let's put this also on true so you can see all of them together make sure you have a comma here save this refresh and there we are for some reason i am oh of course this one should not be here i want to have this one here not true because i want to show see the tick labels save that refresh and there we are so now we remove the grid lines but we have the tick lines still active and the labels as well so this is basically how you can play around with the y scale and remove or add or show or hide every specific item that you want in charts so next what i would recommend you to do is the following if you're going to remove these uh, tick lines and tick labels on the y-axis maybe you would like to have the values on top here which is called data labels. For that, I will highly recommend you to explore this one here, which is the Chart.js data label series. This is a plugin that uses, uses uh, the data labels will be shown on top of the bar, which you can display. And it's a 18, uh, a playlist with 18 videos in here. Very useful as well to make sure it's very visible in a different way or to display the data instead of on the scale on the bars itself.